What's the Yo, deal? We're back. Episode 65. Uh, 65. Uh, the hey. Podcast, man. Loving this energy, man. Mm-hmm. How you say that? Glad to be back. There we go. Man, I hope you're right, Dan. Okay. We out here, oh, though. I doubt it's... <laughs> is it that? I rebound. <laughs> we nice all in our spice. spicy. Uh, yeah, it's very yeah. spicy podcast. I stop it. I said Dorsey. Right? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Jose it. Dose, I'm done. Jose oh, 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 what type of liquor is that? Ketrese, <laughs> ketrese. <laughs> spicy pod, man. I'm sorry, spicy I'm cursing pod. somebody out. This is the spicy pod. Oh, episode. yeah. Sizzling up in here. Champagne, pepper. <laughs> Champagne, man. Pepper. Tabasco. But Drake coming up with new methods, man, of um, not getting trapped, man. We here hey, man, for you. You know we got to start it off with that, Yeah, bro. we, uh, oh, we definitely. God. So many questions. Definitely have to start off with that one, only because it's one of those things where it's like, you know what? You can't fault him for it. If he's not a legend. He should be a legend now. <laughs> Let me yeah, write. Okay. Let me pull up the Big article, facts. man. That's uh, some legendary shit. If you don't know, I'm sure you do. But yeah. yeah. But if you don't know, uh, basically tools, the man. rapper, you know, was having some intercourse with a young woman no or whatnot. Drake, right? And the unknown internet sensation claims she stayed at at, uh, at the rappers, like I guess he ran out of a hotel for a few weeks, you know, got money like that. Okay. She claimed that Drizzy poured hot sauce into a used condom in mm. order to kill his sperm oh after they had sex. Now, you're probably wondering, Damn. how would she know these Flawless things? Victory. Let's get right back into the story. Brutality. After, <laughs> after the rapper allegedly disposed the condom, the Damn. model took it out of the bin and attempted to impregnate herself inside the bathroom. However... She was met with a burning sensation and screamed. The Why woman revealed no. that the accusation and uh, too much hot tea blog and claimed that Drake ran into the bathroom and admitted to pouring hot sauce on the condom. So, so man, what are you doing in here? I mean, what are you? <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> so why, why are you screaming? Are Everything you even, okay? Why are you even yeah. in here doing this? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh. I mean. I can't. What? Wait. Well, I do have one question though. I thought, as a celebrity, if I was in that life, I'd mm-hmm. just flush it. That too. I don't. Yeah. I don't understand why people don't do that. Because back in the day, that was just my what, move. I what guess. I've heard, what a lot of rappers get caught doing, what caught up doing, mm-hmm. is after they're doing their thing with a chick, they'll throw the condom in the trash can, and while the rappers asleep, the woman would actually get the condom and like put it on ice. Mm. Like you know, they got the, yeah. you got the bucket of ice in the hotel rooms. These niggas. I've heard ice. that, and then to where if they will give it to either like their pimp or like the manager, or some shit. This is what uh, somebody has said. The shit has happened a lot. So that's crazy. I've heard that. I've heard that's the turkey crazy. baster. I've heard yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, the turkey baster. Those, I've heard that. I'm like, but I think terrible. this is just my theory. I think Drake was doing a trust test. You know, like mm, a trust fall type was. thing. You know, she was there for a few weeks in the trash can. True. If you decide to put this in you. Surprise, bitch! Because <laughs> if it was the normal, he probably just threw it in the, you know, in the uh, the so, toilet, mm, flush it down. Yeah, yeah flush. Ah. What I used to always do, you know, back in my, you know, back in your days. days. Disclaimer. Da, 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 but now, um, <laughs> I used to run the water in the condom mm-hmm. to make sure there was no hole in it, oh, and smart. then I would shake it just to make sure no weight. Make sure it wouldn't drop, hmm. and then I throw it in the toilet. I thought place. she put water to dilute it. Okay, but no, no, no. At first, I, I was once you said to make sure it was no hole, and I was thinking before you use it, I was like, <laughs> "You getting rid of all the lubricant? What the fuck are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, they go all the good stuff, baby." But oh, uh, it's a new thing that I heard about because <laughs> right? I wanted to dry myself up. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because if she's wet like she says she is, then you know yeah. I don't need. Basically, <laughs> we don't need it then, right? Yeah. We don't need it, right? Because like, that's what y'all be singing about, right? Mm-hmm. What, bro? Yeah. What, right? <laughs> Bro, wop, is, right? Oh, man. First of all, why is that like, Lubo com- condoms if it's wop? <laughs> <laughs> make it make stupid, sense. Bro. Boy, ain't no stupid. way. Sound like we helping. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Two well, main questions, bro. Like, <laughs> who who told Drake to do this? Like, how did he know to do this? Somebody probably. Dope, yeah. I'm sure, I mean, he been in the game. Number one, bro. Like, bro, the girl time. didn't 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 see the color orange in it. Like, how the hell did you not know? This he shit probably was just dabbed a little bit, man. It don't take much. Well, I, I guess so. That's just you got to think about it too. It could have been a colored condom. It could have been a it condom. Could've, it could have could've been, been a condom. Been, yeah. You know, mm-hmm. strap yeah, up that yellow. Sometimes <laughs> maybe he just put like a drop. Maybe a drop kills it all. You know, mm-hmm. you never yeah. know. And then mix it up. He, 
Now we know so- <laughs> yeah, chemistry, folks. Hey, what are y'all yeah. doing that moment though? Y'all just had a you know session I'm with a girl. I'm just gonna give this, the the evil smirk. Exactly, man. Get your bitch ass. Yeah, yeah. Man, 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 Drake. That's what's up, bags. Drake is a part of it. So for now on, Drake, I'll be Drake. having my Trojan and a, a packet of a spicy ketchup on me. So <laughs> shit get real, bro. I know. Just keep do. some Taco you, Bell Diablo. You gotta get you some, good. Uh, yep. go. Oh yep. yeah. Oh yeah. That'll kill anything. <laughs> that will. Yeah. Taste buds included. All of it. <laughs> but the question is, when she. Can she win this lawsuit? Like I don't think she can. Yeah, she's not know. winning that. Nah, she's not winning. Yeah, that. like he tried to that's pull her a fault. fast one on them. Yeah, like, he definitely yeah. did. He didn't force her to do it. Yeah, he, yep. like, that's he was, what you get. She you was trying to trap him. Mm-hmm. Bro, this is the marketing genius, bro. Drake needs to have his own hot sauce product. I I would. Hey, I'm telling y'all, I would. So, yeah. Boys, boys would buy it. <laughs> boys, yeah. boys would buy it. I'm just waiting. We'll buy it, and it will be. Put go ahead here above the inner clip Like go ahead and capitalize on the Drake's hot sauce. Yes. I just know there's gonna be some bars oh, directed yeah. at this young I'm, lady, I'm ready. and I can't wait to hear. It. When his next EP, he just put out an album, so it's an EP next. So the demo, the you lost tapes. Know. Yeah, so, so. He, he got some more sauce tapes. Sauce tapes. Sauce, sauce tapes. tapes, man. Uh, sign me up. I'm I'm ready to hear the subliminals, man. For real. Add in the hot Drake, sauce. At the I end. thought I could trust the. <laughs> You know, some shit like that. Oh, yeah, he gonna, oh, Looking man. through the condiments, I saw the mustard. That's probably what he said when he walked in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Baby girl, where you yeah. been? I told you I been soused up. Not the head. Oh, no. Been soused up. Y'all better learn, man. Hey, and, I and, told you he coming out with 2.30 in Louisiana. <laughs> 2.30 in Louisiana. Oh, oh. That's oh, gonna be the, oh, I'm gonna done. be the next time. I'm gonna be featuring it's Wayne. Time and date. Featuring Wayne, I'm with it. Two third in Louisiana. You yeah. gonna hear that lighter flick? Yup, yup. Man, these hoes crazy. I taught you that, my boy. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I taught you well. <laughs> I taught you well. Yeah, I'm, I'm the, the one who told Wayne him to do rap it. About doing, like, mm-hmm. I'm the one who told him to do it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I told him flush it. He said, Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a saucy. <laughs> <laughs> I, the fact <laughs> that. You have to do this. It's, it's quite sad, man. But it is, bro. It, we was talking about this earlier, where it's like people be wanting to, you know, be famous and be in that lifestyle. Yeah. But then you have to deal with stuff like this all the time. Imagine bro. you just getting to connect with someone. Apparently, they were, you know, Definitely. in the hotel for like weeks. So obviously, they're talking, getting to know each other, hanging mm-hmm. out. And imagine you doing this, and then all of a sudden, you cold. you exactly. see someone trying to, you know. Dig out the trash to potentially have your child. That's like, cold. you know, without. I'm sorry, Adonis just looked like he has a good life, and I just wanted to. And it's one of those things where he's doing the right thing. He's wearing protection, he's doing the right thing, he's and still, up. he got to deal with this type of stuff. And I, I feel like people, they don't realize the dark side of yeah. being famous, being mm-hmm. being Bro, rich look. and famous. There's always a, a good and a bad, and the negative side sometimes outweigh the good, especially yeah, when man. you're dealing with something like this. Like, mm-hmm. that's, that could be, Brittany you know. Renner is a prime suspect. Yeah. Yeah. Look, man, here's two things to definitely live by, man. I'm sure there's many sayings, but these are the main two. It's two sides of every story, and be careful what you wish for, man. Mm-hmm. Like people, y'all want this fame and money, bro. They All deal with right. a lot of bullshit too, just as much as mm-hmm. regular life, bro. And that for instance, like I know we're joking about this, but in actuality, bro, that's like effed up that once again this person that he thought he could trust, or you know, some with mm-hmm. actually trying to trap him from like, damn, okay. You about to have another baby, but that's more money to where like the baby wasn't made out of love and nothing. It was, you know, yeah, over and, that. You and know? that's the type of it's shit terrible. that they can make songs like No Friends in the exactly. industry. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Shit yeah. like that. Yeah. We need that heat. Yeah. He don't no got pun the trust. intended. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, no pun intended. He don't got the trust. <laughs> yeah. And it's crazy because and it just, gets worse and worse. It does. Yeah. The more money you have, the more popularity you have, the more people will try to befriend you and yeah. get take close advantage. to you and then exactly. take advantage of you yep. and that's why you know that lifestyle it, no I, I was telling them like I'm I'm cool for being recognized for you know what we got going on here Thanks. but I ain't trying to be super famous to the point where I can't even you know get to know somebody just on a, a business relationship yeah. And they not nah, trying to like, I mean, no take new friends, extra really, money like, and stuff like that, or even just go to a public place mm-hmm. just to chill. And then someone can pretend, oh well, say say you go to, go out and about, and you accidentally spill a drink on somebody. They know who you are. Oh yeah. my bad, clean up, get them, maybe get them a new drink or whatever. Then days later, you get a lawsuit coming your way. This is crazy, yeah. <laughs> you be like, wait, what? Bro, oh, celebrities don't even gotta be in the same room and then get sued. Uh, by something that you allegedly did or Not something. Yeah. Your name was affiliated with somebody or yeah. something. Mm-hmm. I mean, which is stupid. Like that shit's sad, man. Yeah, mm-hmm. So 
Well, I mean, that's why they always say the more money, no more problems, like y'all been saying. I'm starting to believe it, though, man. People, I never really wanted to people believe People wonder that. why celebrities be going crazy. Yeah, you know? bro. Yeah. We be looking at them on TMZ like, man, how the hell you million dollars, honey, million? Yeah, you nah, tripping. Bro. But you don't know. You don't know you what don't that's know. like, bro. Mm-hmm. You don't know what they to deal with. To not trust with. nobody and, you know, mm-hmm. family always coming at you, you know. Mm-hmm. If you make a mistake, you, you're you the ultimate villain. Like, these same people don't make mistakes. Yep. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Which like, is why I feel the, the bad the most for, like, People like Bow Wow and like the ones that grew up mm-hmm. on camera. They grew up in because LA, like huh? every mistake you made is documented. Yeah, you, know? you know, like people normal, you know, the average person is not famous can make all kinds of mistakes and you won't even know nothing about yeah. it or hear a peep. But yep. you know, or you incriminate yourself like Twitter. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, oh, people that yeah. tweeted old things when they was in high school and college and it ended up biting them in the ass. It's stupid, bro. Fifteen Everybody years. Was young and dumb at but point, that's bro. just a that's just a glimpse of yeah. Like a celebrity's life, like you do something random, yep. you go turn up with the homies, get drunk one night, and just do something silly. Mm-hmm. That's something that's we've all I done, and it's like, nah, you on camera because, oh, I know that's so and so. Cancel, record him. Yeah, you on TMZ now. Yep. So like, damn, you can't do nothing. No, you can't, man. That's why you know we what we try to do, what we try to bring is just you know bring the realism that we're like y'all. <laughs> we we bleed oh, yeah, the I'll same, normal, exactly, same. People. Like we yep. bleed the same, man. We are normal people. We just been blessed to be put in a situation we're in. You know what I'm saying? Thanks. And we not better than the next man. So, yeah. you know, what we doing, y'all could be doing too or even just expiring to do something mm-hmm. else. But don't get too caught up into these celebrities' lives and, you know, wh- you know, wanting to be rich and famous and everyone know your name. Bro, it, it, look, it costs to be the boss, bro. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. It's a price to pay, man. Yeah, it's like, always a price to pay, man. So. And we don't, we don't put on no character either. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Circling back to us, like, yeah, I commend the alien videos. That are still cool, my bad, bro. Yeah, no, nah, that's like, true. That's and true. even the ones you see that kind of like low key, I'm like, it makes sense now because look at this yeah. shit I got to deal with. Like, they yes, got certain bro. people, certain people that look like they'd be cool. Like, Snoop look like he'd be cool as hell. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. Every way I've Cole. seen him, he never Cole. Cole look like he'll be cool. I would definitely be um, like on some J. Cole type. And yeah, Kendrick, he don't even be on. He stay yeah, away from yeah. social media. He stay out the way. He yeah. stay out the way. He be doing his own yeah. thing. And, you know, sometimes you have to be like that. Unbothered, Unbothered bro. Bothered. Yeah, not trying to do anything for clout or nothing like mm-hmm. that. Like, mm-hmm. I'm good. Wait until the album drops and then start a beef. Yeah. <laughs> when we going to stop doing that, man? When we going to stop creating beef? Shit, out of date. For yeah. album promotion. Yeah. yeah. Like, That's kind of played And out. stop saying you about to retire just to come out with a surprise EP or album next year. <laughs> So just let it go. I don't know if you heard Rod Wave said that recently that he, he wants to retire. I'm like, I'm okay. so tired of that. Oh, I didn't exactly. know that. Logic did that. Oh, exactly. yeah, Logic yeah. Did that. and he yeah. put out an album. I'm like, bro, you went on this whole tirade saying I'm like, done I with can't this. leave it alone. Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> well, I really, and I really like Rod Wave, but his music is getting more and more depressing. Yeah, it, like, it, I can't listen to it. I thought it was full. depressing from the beginning. Well, I guess because I didn't like listen to a full, you know, I just hit the song, the hit song that was on the radio. That's I, understandable. I, I vibe yeah. out to that. I didn't listen to like a full album. I tried. Well, I did. <laughs> an album? I didn't listen. Like it was one of those, oh, this sounds like that song. Oh, this yeah. sounds like that song. Yeah. Next. Oh, this sounds like that song. Yeah. Oh, this is a cool song. That's the problem. Kind of sounds like the other song, but yeah. it's a cool song. Yeah. Next song. Oh, this is cool. It's the one Next about song. him dying. That, <laughs> you don't carry me. I'm, I'm like, whoa, whoa, what you talking song. about? Like, <laughs> damn. Like, bro, and, I, and I like that song. But it's I like it too. Hell. It's cool, but <laughs> when you listen to it, There was another one. He's like, like, man, I really, it finally hit me. I don't want to be here no more. I'm like, whoa, come on now. Like, I get it, but then like, it's bro, some depressing right, ass shit. Wait, it's should really be li- depressing. He should be listening to it. I'm like, you got something you want to talk about? <laughs> right. <laughs> one of my favorite songs from him is called Pills and Dollar Bills. It's crazy, man. And that song. If I, it's depressing as shit. Right. <laughs> like, I just don't want to get look, too consumed by depressing music because you don't yeah, ever know. What's we grew up from with zero. Us I, I was just about to say, so that's why. Even I back then, I'm like zero. I'm a huge Randy, but bro, some of your shit back then, I, I couldn't crazy. listen to too yeah. much zero yeah. because of that. He'll yeah. make you not want to trust no damn. Body. No, yeah. but bro, I listen to zero. I'm mad for a day. Like I'm just <laughs> angry. Who in this phone? I'm one deep and fuck all y'all. Exactly. And I'm like, but yeah, yo, you see in high school, you group a whole bunch of niggas around. I only got three phone, three numbers in my phone. That's Damn, I forgot that lyric on. I think it was crack. Yeah. I think so. He said he only got three. And he named them or something. I was just like, man, Damn, bro. Like, phone all you all type of space. You get yeah. no love. Yeah. All you can get is a fuck you. <laughs> like that. It's still, a, it's still a groove, though. It, 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 it is, jam. bro. All this shit jam. It was just I like, don't damn. need no help, my mm-hmm. nigga. Which was dope to so depressing. I'm like, so my depressing, bro. <laughs> when I was down and out, nobody want to come and kick it. 
for those of you that don't know Zero outside of Texas or outside of the South, because Zero, mm-hmm. he, nigga, he's really like the underground king. In general. Mm-hmm. I, I suggest you look him up, but then again, you know, he's he drank. Uh, he hard though. That's my song. Though. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. It's, it's, it's the same thing. He, zero hard though. Yeah, he can make mm-hmm. some dope music just as much. He can make some depression music. I, but listen, be, I can't listen to it all day it, no more. No, no hell, no. I couldn't do it before. To be mm-hmm. honest with you, like mm-hmm. I jammed it. Don't get me wrong, but I like I skip around because too much zero for me. Yeah, that too, is bad yeah. for my soul. That, that, that was one of those. Exactly, that yeah. made me run around with a gun and try to shoot somebody. Look, we in the all y'all. We in the getting our hair cut in my cousin's house in the garage. Yep, zero. Ah, nah, man. I, you gotta switch it up, man. Unknown location. That shit like, put you in a different yeah. state. <laughs> he said, unknown That's location. not a good mindset it's to be in, yeah, bro. Yeah. Niggas, listen to, niggas used to listen to zero, like, yes. religiously. Yes. Exactly, bro. Like, bro this is why you want to go rob. This is why you want to trust me. <laughs> exactly. You start beef for no reason. That when nigga I, did not mug you, bro. When, you, when I started realizing that shit was affecting my mood bro, for the day, I was like, I uh-uh. thought Zero was like uh-uh. beyond the villain of H Town, bro. Back then. <laughs> he looked scary and he made music <laughs> that villain. was frightening. I'm like, bro. <laughs> he said he said frightening. Villain. So villain, bro. I'm like, but now you see him how he is now and stuff. He's more cool. So Trey, like, Trey sounded more villainous. And I love Trey. Oh, yeah, but dude, he was dude, dark, dude. too. He definitely. Yeah. He, he, both of them were. Niggas want to talk about yeah, the asshole. Niggas talking all the shit. What the fuck you niggas? <laughs> 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 my favorite song for him was like, let me live my life. That shit was like, I ain't changed. That was dope. That was a bad combination. Let me live my life. 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 Let a shout out to Trader too. Now you yeah. see him now. He's a humanitarian, bro. He's the H Town hero. Yeah, so Facts. that's Facts. why I liked um, Chameleon. There. Chameleon there oh, was different. very Chameleon vibrant, was super, man. super positive, um, and mm-hmm. he was positive. Barely any cuss words. Mm-hmm. Didn't mm-hmm. curse. Yeah, not really. Yeah, he Bars. had a whole mixtape without cuss words at yeah. all. Like, mm-hmm. who does that and still he make hits? Still couldn't. Mm-hmm. You couldn't tell because, bro, he just dude could spit. You know, definitely. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He was so, crazy with it. Sorry for our Houston little. Yeah, you know, that was a Houston lesson. Of the background, days, but yeah, it, 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 used to it all stems from segment. just how powerful the music can be, Definitely, especially bro. if you you know listen to listening to a certain type yeah. all the time. That can affect your mood, bro. Definitely, bro. Yes. If you want to listen to you know some cheerful stuff or some upbeat stuff, maybe about to get on the workout, mm-hmm. that'll help. But if yeah. you, you know, what I'm saying, can't down. be listening to NBA Young Boy all guy. Oh, hell I, no, 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 I can no, only listen to him oh, working no. out or if I'm driving oh, no, no, fast. No, no, so so really NBA young. Young boy it has stuff. to be certain moves. Yeah, I gotta because, drive fast or be working out, Bruh, bruh When I tell you, I I was looking for like one song where he did not say anything about murder. Shh, you can hang that up. Yeah, you can definitely not hang one. Not even a love song. He was talking about love. And he was like, I'm, I'll kill you if you blah, blah, blah. I was like, damn. Now, I thought he was about to make bro, it. Like all the youngsters, bro, <laughs> they're jamming. And like you saw that meme where dude was staying at like the TV. Mm-hmm. And said, this ain't be a young boy jamming his playlist on YouTube through the PS4 <laughs> like eight hours ago all day. And I'm like, bro, I believe that. I feel like that's what they do. Yeah. Yeah, nah, for sure. And man. I get it. You know, that's your niche. Like, that's where you're, that's, <laughs> right. that's your lane. Yeah, I that's get your it. lane. You know, he for the young, you know, of course, the old, you know. It's not even just that, you know, because you got your gangster rappers that, you know, rap about shit like that. Yeah. But. <clears throat> I feel like older gangster rappers has some type of versatility. They have some soul because mm-hmm. they grew up on more like old school music. Yeah. So even what they they um like the songs that they sample, you know oh, what I'm saying? Yeah, they even, they would sample them in a certain way. And, like um, even think about like Yo Gotti, uh, Jeezy, and like yeah, uh, Gucci, like all of it. It it has everybody so- had that. You know they they had a a cap almost, especially mm-hmm. like with with um with what's his name um. Snowman, cheesy, G- uh, yeah, yeah. Young mm-hmm. cheesy. Like you could tell, like yeah. in a way, to see his growth, definitely man. will let you know, like man, it was something there. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? He was just getting in how he could get it, you know. But at the end of the day, you never <clears> want to <throat> knock a person for that. But I always appreciate people that's coming out the game trying to reach yes. out to people like, hey, mm-hmm. look, I did this, and it may have looked cool when I was doing it, but no, I was at the worst yep. health of my life. I was at such when people was yeah. on when Gucci. Was talking about on the syrup and the lean and all that. Like mm-hmm. he was like, bro, like you can see him in interviews sometimes. He was People out. wouldn't even know they was there, almost. Yeah. Or he'll be tripping out just saying whatever. Mm-hmm. He went on that little tirade <laughs> and stuff. I yeah. remember the the infamous yep. Angela Yee interview when he was um oh, my she was God. interviewing him. He kept mm-hmm. like trying to shoot his shot at him and. And uh, they, that was, and when he was on the breakfast, he's like, "You tried to talk to me too." Like he was saying that she tried to uh, get with him. She's like, "When? I don't remember that." And so I had to go back and look. And um, he was like trying to shoot his shot the whole, you know. And she was just kind of carrying on the interview, mm-hmm. trying to be professional. Mm-hmm. But I mean, it's just in the moments where you just 
you on drugs and you just, yep. you know, you just, really you know, in man. the in the moment and you're not really thinking about your health and all of other stuff. And then when they recover, they be like, hey, man, look, I was damn near dying. Yep. Right there. You yep. know, crazy, so bro. everything that you see ain't cool. Hell, mm-hmm. I remember lean from being from Houston mm-hmm. and to say I've never had none never you know, had it bro you know, it's crazy. I'm gonna keep it 100 somebody my size I'm glad I never took a sip cause yeah I mean but shit you <laughs> think about the people that, that was sipping it that yeah. was yo bigger than you bigger than me mm-hmm. yeah you know like, a lot of them bro that killed a Big lot Mo. of people yep. yeah DJ Screw yeah, bar like baby and all that. Yeah. Give me some vibes, man. You know, that like, was some vibes and that. Sh- I ain't know what I was looking at. I'm like, this cup. Yeah, I don't know. There's some two pur- cups with some purple, purple punch. Yeah, look good. Purple punch. Because I heard like, nah, ladies. I literally thought it was like, this, in there. yeah, I thought it was like this oh, was back then. Some spray. Like, nope. No, it's not some recipe. It may sound good, but you ain't gonna be moving for a while. I want to say a pint is like what. A it depends. Or it depends. Street value or whatever. Well, promethazine, the type of brand, but because they took it off the market to yeah. where you yeah, couldn't just get access to it. Yeah, see, mm-hmm. But that's it the problem. Back then. And then mm-hmm. it, it looks so appealing. It looked good. It looked you good see what I'm saying? Yeah. So, and then the it, way people it was, drunk it, it's, it's very sweet. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> that's all I needed. I love, man. I was a 99 cent juice from fr- well, uh, Fiesta guy. Just not, yeah. So you give me something sweet, killing the buckets on a weekly basis, but love. I couldn't. But I want to kind of. Piggyback of what uh, uh, Steve was talking about when he was uh, saying on one of the love songs NBA Youngboy was talking about, like, if you try to leave me talking to this girl, I'll shoot you. I said, it was too late, man. You, you do good for that. Well, you know, <laughs> we say, start yeah. talking about lean and shit, so. <laughs> <laughs> so but let's I, lean off this topic. Right? And <laughs> <laughs> but uh, basically. Segway. <laughs> um, I don't know if y'all know uh, Money Bag Yo Girl, uh, Ari Fletcher. Yeah. She had, went on a podcast and she was pretty much. Saying those sentiments on the on I forgot who podcast it was, but she was saying uh she want oh, money back yo to like pull a gun out and show show uh show me, you know what I'm saying, bitch, don't you know you ain't okay, you ain't see. leaving. You know, I wish you would leave the, No way, she out. wants him to pull a gun out on her. Like she likes that type of energy. Oh, so that's yeah. why it's funny you said that because she man. she came out and said, you know, she likes that type of energy and then because of that, she got backlash, obviously, because that's a toxic situation. You know what I'm saying? Very toxic. Someone and stupid. Like, like if you want to leave, like you you want to gotta you know pull a gun out on you. And granted, she. You know what's crazy? It's not even weird to me to hear that. It's not. I've it's, heard some crazy no, ass people. Say some shit like it's not business. surprising because you're too nice. She she yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Boy, don't get me started. That's a whole nother. Not you're too nice. Yeah. I need you. you to beat so on, you too, right? I need you to beat on me type shit. Too. Like, I'm like, you want me? You, you want me to directly be an asshole your, to you? Speak your truth. That's a mental problem that you have. Mental problem. Like that's actually a mental problem. So I'm gonna finish last. After you stupid. So after she came out saying that, and then she got the backlash. She made. She hopped on live and basically she was like you know what i'm saying i don't really care what y'all talking about it ain't even that deep boom 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 well she was you know she was partnering up with uh rihanna fenty well they dropped her oh rihanna, really? rihanna wait, wait, dropped wait, wait. cancel fin- culture is happening to women <laughs> oh yeah, my rihanna, god rihanna, uh, i somebody, mean hey somebody check you gotta, out you gotta understand what what <laughs> like, the company this is this is yeah, rihanna, rihanna, the one so. who actually dealt with that type of shit so they dropped her <laughs> she got to drop her though That's yeah. smart facts huh, okay. so they dropped her she after, don't support that by default after she got dropped then now she's running on uh, Ari Fletcher, she's now in the campaign of trying to do damage control, but it's it's like it's one of those things like she's trying to do like seminars on domestic abuse Wait, and stuff. Who, Ari, like that. yeah, Ari, she's like trying to oh my basically God, no, no. PR, PR, yeah. yeah, PR. She's PR. trying to you know double back down, but it was one of those things where you had opportunities nah, to be you like, talk to your shit originally. Mm-hmm. For the record, I was gonna was. do this before I got dropped. You can't be talking like, like that. You can't be you talking can't, like that yeah. when you know you're connected with something like that. Mm-hmm. You know? It's one thing if you were just an uh, uh, independent act or something. Yeah. You know, you can say whatever the hell you want, be as toxic boosie. as you like. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Be boozy. Be yeah. Mm-hmm. Boosie your Russ. life away or whatever. Be that's yo. Mm-hmm. And the problem with that is that's women don't realize men do whatever to get you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So if that's the type of energy you want, that's the type of shit that entices niggas to be on that. Mm-hmm. So they, because they feel like, oh man, in order for me to get a baddie, I need to be a rough nigga. I need to be a hard ass. I need to go to jail, get a few stripes. Mm-hmm. Hell no, nah. nah, it's not the case. Because they want it that bad. That's yeah, you want it. crazy. You ruin your life for something like that, bro. It just it, it ain't worth it. And the crazy thing is, bro, in this day and age, you got a lot of you know domestic violence. You know, when it comes to the women and whatnot, they're definitely dealing through that. You hear somebody say something like this, I'm like, okay, that just kills the 
the ambition of like, you know, we need to eradicate, you know, like, you know, women that are being beaten, you know, mm-hmm. I mean, it, it's, terrible. Women. it's so contradictory. Very yeah, contra- it, it makes exactly. this hard. It just makes a, a circle of, yeah. of shit of shit that's going on because now mm-hmm. you're like, damn, do we stop them from beating on her? Or do, right. Do we not? But then it's crazy because the women, the women that bring up that type of stuff, they be like, yeah, I want a man to rough me up, blah, blah, mm-hmm. blah. Okay. Then they shit. end up getting beat up so bad mm-hmm. to where they have to call the cops. Mm-hmm. Type mm-hmm. Shit. You know, now they're like, I wouldn't expect them to beat me up like this. Mm-hmm. Oh, but here's my baby. I love him. Like, what the fuck is it? Which one is it? Nah, it'll be the same. Terrible, it'll be the bro. same women like that yeah. that feel like that, think like that, be saying goals about the Obamas and mm-hmm. Michelle Obama. Yeah, it's like, I'm confused. Yeah. Which which one I do you want? I'm so confused. Which, what do you want to be? They don't you want to be successful I'm keeping in, <laughs> in a certain light. I want him to be a gangster, but with straight A's. Right. Exactly. Which is possible, but. And he can't skip school either. Yeah. Bro. And he can't actually do the thug shit. Oh, he got to, yeah, yeah, but he, he can. Yeah, exactly. but he has to do the thug he gotta, shit. He got to have at a the blicking. same time. Yeah, that's confusing. You know, six figure. He got to be thirty feet tall. How old is like, he? At least. Uh, I'm not sure. Let me look it up. Let's see if Google I, give us. I the need correct. him. I need him six foot six. Yeah, they just two fifty with muscle. You just aim a little bit too high. Dark like, skin. She's twenty six. Full beard. Twenty six. She's young. Yeah, she's young. <laughs> she's young. She's from Chicago, so you know she dealt with some all of that. I don't have. That's you know, probably childhood trauma. Yeah, childhood trauma. Yeah, but yeah. It's, it's one of those things where it's like, that's if, the environment. If that's, if that's, is that the toxic stuff? You like cool, but when you start going out and, and promoting and, that, man, and saying it, and then when you get backlash and then you come at other people like y'all just soft or boom, 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 y'all you don't really care. Then it's like, well, not all of us are into that. Not mm-hmm. all of us like that. There are some people that are dealing with that, and you know. Her response was, I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, yeah. That's that, so, so insensitive, man. It's insensitive. She says that now because she got she still got her fan base. Yeah. All that starts drawing up like the Fendi deal and stuff like that. Oh, yeah. That but was the, they don't understand, ball. bro. Influence is powerful. Yeah, it is, bro. You're going out there Especially promoting now. that. Yeah. 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 Like, You're going out there promoting that to some 16-year-old mm-hmm. girl. She probably cute. think that shit is all right. Influence it's, is so powerful. We got men out here wearing Drake hearts in their head. And they look in their oh hair. cringe. Yes, I don't like look cringe. Like if if that don't tell you enough about influence, that, yeah, I'm yeah. sorry, bro. If I see you. And it's nothing right it's now, nothing wrong bro. with you having your preference or, or whatever you ever whatever toxic no, damn preference well, you nobody like. Nobody didn't do that before Drake. Oh, like, bro, just, but nobody was doing that shit before Drake. Yeah, okay, Osiris has it. I'm like, bro, why are you why? why I feel like it? now I know why barbers are starting to go up on their prices. Because they gotta do extra shit. Shit. Nowadays, niggas be wanting the most. Hey, give me a volcano and then, mm-hmm. you know, Bruh, earthquake it around the back. I seen a dude in Houston designed in his head. The skyline mm-hmm. designed in oh, his head. He paid yeah. over 100 something, 200. Oh, yeah. I did. You got to like, be an artist, what, artist for real. What for real. the fuck? Just for it to grow a week. Yeah, yeah, about, for about a week. <laughs> Take a picture of that real quick. Yeah. I can mean your love for Houston. <laughs> Going bro, viral. Come on now. That bitch like, gonna look like uh, I am Legend City right after like <laughs> right exactly <laughs> three days in. Fact. I am Legend. <laughs> We're cool oh, city. Oh, messed up like, Houston. Right. Fact. <laughs> Nah, so, I couldn't. Yeah. Uh, it ain't that enough patience yeah, in the world. Like, so. Nah, I'm like, I'm like I, I was thinking how long that process. Like, was that like a tattoo process at that point? Like, yeah, I took some because that dude. He was probably like with the blade. Eh. He probably had the little blade. I think mm-hmm. they got a, a edge up. Nah, nah, hold on, hold on, bro. You got to put the window <laughs> cleaners on this side right here. Bro. Like, nah, bro. The window like, cleaners. You got, I'm trying to be more authentic. And then like, throw some, uh, <laughs> then throw some H-Town heads up. Yeah. Exactly right. <laughs> Behind the city like this. Mm-hmm. Nah, I don't see my mama house, man. You got to put her house yeah, on Yeah, yeah, you got to put a homestead too, Come bro. On, bro. Like, <laughs> bro, it's a haircut, my boy. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, get your ass out the seat, dog. Come on. So, yeah, man. I'm, I'm, uh, I feel bad for the nigga waiting to go next. <laughs> Bottle went hey, on. I, been, hey, no, I don't care anybody, bro. Who got me? <laughs> what's y'all? What's y'all limit on waiting? Like, how many heads before you? When you walk up, you walk none, up. None just over walked three. In, yeah, three, I don't do three. anything over three. Yeah, yeah. three is probably. And it depends because you're about to get some shit with three people. If it's three, right. I gotta have like nothing that day. Because yeah. if I have yeah. anything, I'm like, well, three too much. I'm leaving. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> shit. I hate when I, I used to call and I would Well, go. back when I went to the barbershop. But yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, oh, well, I've been self barbering myself. But I I'm mean, <laughs> it's when the moms walking there with four kids. Oh, it's rap. Four boys. And I come in, y'all. I mean, y'all do what you put, <laughs> dog. The moms usually end up, so but the moms be knowing what they doing, yeah. bro. The, the moms going there with the small ass skirt or them tight ass <laughs> pants. How many you got? Always. Them, them booty yep. shaking sundresses. 
For no reason. They know niggas in there. You about to pay 14th for heads, right. damn it. And my, mm-hmm. my barber used to turn my chair. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm like, hey, man, I'm married. Appreciate you, though. Good looking, man. Like, good looking, though. They always want to let you see what's going on. Oh, especially the... Shout out to the women that be selling stuff. You got the good marketing. Going to a barbershop, dress down, and going to a barbershop. Oh, they know what they are. Yep. I don't mm-hmm. give a damn. You selling cigarette butts. <laughs> I don't even smoke. <laughs> yeah, like, I don't, yeah, them boys Them boys don't even give a damn. No, nope. nah, but they, like, hey, they, they know. She look good. And she know yep. they got cash. Yep. You had to get your <laughs> hair cut. You and ain't niggas, coming there, bro. Yeah, but you got to think, niggas do that because they want to, you know, that's when they try yeah. to show they stick. So they, they oh, I got you. Mm-hmm. Let me yeah. for them. I'll here's buy the rest. Here's a tip. Yeah, yeah it's, <laughs> not, not with that back roll. Bro, out. That, that reminds me last time I went to uh, this other barbershop. Uh, buddy, they called him the popcorn man. He sold different flavors of popcorn. Okay. And now, once again, I, that's what's up, bro. You on your hustle. But I have never seen, there were five barbers, bro. Everybody was in the chair. When somebody said, hey, man, the popcorn man out in the parking lot, I never seen four grown ass barbers just run out the door while I'm wow. like hey, what the hell what, what do you got he, alcohol flavor right. he got every like different <laughs> type of flavor from like fruits to like pizza and stuff like that it's like popcorn flavored how he doing that I don't know. He, pizza he's from Chicago he gets it from Chicago and he he has it flown down here or something oh, like wow. that he on his he he's on, his, on and bro I was right. it was funny cause I'm mean, like I was mad at the same time like once again this one barber he's always on his bullshit but I laugh cause seeing like these grown ass men Get excited! It was like ice cream with little kids, bro. The ice cream man pulled up. <laughs> oh my like, god! Like it's like they heard the little noise. Yeah, bro. The, <laughs> instrumental. Oh, the, the popcorn man good. out there. I'm like, bro. I'm trying to get my face right, and I'm like, y'all going ham over this popcorn, bro. When you think That's about, crazy. you think about all the marketing as Definitely, a kid, yeah. like with the ice cream truck, mm-hmm. they knew what they was doing, bro. Going yeah, to man. a neighborhood on a hot evening, but for real, when the kids are out of school, well now, I'll sound that alarm off. <laughs> yep. Yeah, now you don't really see it too much now. Nah, nah you, you really see the don't. Rosper man, dog, little Mexican man on the bike, bro, with the uh, oh, lotes yeah, and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah. Bro, he know what he doing. Dog. He the truth. He's nah, the he, truth. He's yes. the real American Got the Topicos and all, yeah, all everything, man. <laughs> this little me. horn, bro. I remember that being on the north side in my auntie house, man. Mm-hmm. 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 Boys used to be coming through, man. Bro, they, they my past committed. job, bro, every school, mainly predominantly like, you know, Mexican or yep. probably like mixed urban. You had, I like that mixed urban. Mixed right? urban. Mixed you urban. had you know like people picking up their kid and stuff like that, and sure enough, bam, he was he was posted up right in the corner, and yep. it was packed. I'm like, bro, especially if kids walking home. Exactly. Shit, yep. Go ahead and Man, you know, little kids, oh, that's all they gonna eat for dinner. Like, yep. so, I remember when they used to have a breakfast tacos, um, before school. Somebody mm-hmm. would come and sell yep. breakfast yep. tacos. Yep. Oh, that is bro, yep. I'm talking about. The best tacos. Them boys was racking up they on know. us. <laughs> Bro, we, but I miss our food, man. Mm-hmm. We had the food. We had the regular bag of hot chips for 99 cents. Mm-hmm. Fruitopia. Crazy, bro. Oh. Yeah, Fruitopia, bro. Oh. You had 75 cents in the third grade. You was the motherfucking <laughs> man. Right. I had, if I had a dollar fifty, I was a happy man. I had them Fruitopia with the Mambos. The man. Ooh, boy. Boy, boy could tell me nothing. <laughs> I remember we used to be able to get uh, cheese on the yeah. chicken. Yeah. You used cheese. to be able to buy hot fries and then they put open them up it. and they'll put cheese, cheese on it. Bro, bro, that shit. They did it oh, for you? They yeah. did it for you. You oh, had to go to another was, line. That shit was, I don't know why we was eating that on the regular. Right. That with milk. Not you good. Good. Still having an iron stomach. We used to do it, but I didn't know they did it like that. That's bro, cool bro. that they for you And we used to be able to get chicken tenders. Yep. You get a chicken tender basket with cheese on it. Would you like to have cheese on there? Yes, I would. Bro, <laughs> Frito that was a delicacy. <laughs> that was a delicacy. Bro. Boys used to be running. As soon as that lunch bell rang, yeah. boys was on their way. Them, them chicken wings was hitting too, boy. High what school, they put in bro, a little cracker something. They changed the game to where it was forty cent, you know, reduced lunch for regular food. Mm-hmm. And all of a sudden, you, they had changed lunch. it to Ooh. where it was just forty cent for the snack bar line, boy. <laughs> That was the best thing ever. <laughs> it was, bro. Because I got reduced lunch during that period, and they had changed it for like like all the snacks, all the ice cream, so you can get the little dark cone, the choco yeah. cone, all mm-hmm. the, whatever ice cream you wanted. For, like, you see, they ate. Well, I was like, <laughs> right, right, right. right. <laughs> I was not on reduced lunch. I'm keeping a hundred, so I, I never always remember that. My, we three got something Chick-fil-A, for snack, we but we got water. I got reduced. I got reduced right, lunch baby. for like three years. Yeah. It's, they weren't in a row. It was random years because I moved around Houston. So like mm-hmm. when I was on the north side, I know I had reduced lunch for like a year. I moved to the third ward, got reduced lunch. Moved back to the north side, got reduced lunch again. 
And I think I got it one more time in like so maybe four. One more time That's in uh, high school. I don't know how I got it. That's how you know. We tried a few times. They said my mama made too much money at Walmart. Yeah, so, my, they yeah. In high school, I shouldn't have had money. it at all. And I they, just, they I think we kind of like kudos to you. We finessed that. <laughs> they used to get on boys paying for free lunch. Mm-hmm. Like Damn. you remember that? Mm-hmm. Like you was eating that free lunch, bro. <laughs> Best believe, boys was about to flame you. That it, it, it didn't like, make damn, no bro. sense, bro. I gotta eat shit. I gotta starve in order to, to yeah. be cool, like, bro. We mm-hmm. all broke, nigga. Yeah, we really <laughs> all broke <laughs> for real, bro. I just want to go back now and talk shit. Yeah, but I got extra cheese. Exactly. Yep. That's it. <laughs> Man, fuck your cheese. <laughs> That'd be the one thing they got. Mm-hmm. How your mama getting that food? <laughs> that money for that lunch every day. Mm-hmm. We wearing damn near the same <laughs> fat form shoes. We all wear the same. Walk, walk around with but, Swiss. But we when it came man. with the lunch, that's when boys started different. Different. Mm-hmm. It got different. The class oh. level. Oh, we got yeah. the same stuff on. But I'm eating the Cheetos yeah. with the cheese. You eating that free stuff. Yeah, you eating so that free lunch. you really ain't that <laughs> free lunch. Free yeah, I'm like, man, bro, yeah. we got the same shit on with you. I look crispy. Mean? I look uh, crusty as chicken patty. I just wish I could go back, go ahead and look at the property of the area to everybody's zone to that middle school, <laughs> and then tell you the median yes, yep. household income, <laughs> and mm-hmm. then show you we all in this together. We all yep. in this. We all broke, bro. Together. Yeah, let's all yep. survive. Facts. Yeah, we facts, ain't bro, at no like, damn private school. Exactly. Mm-hmm. No. We nah. in the slums, damn it. Yeah, so we, we ain't getting slums, laptops, so. nothing. Yep. This is just some funny shit, but. So if you're going through that now, praying for you, man. We with you. We been Definitely, there. Man. At least you're able to watch this. Yeah, yeah. yeah and exactly, and it tough, I ain't gonna lie, it toughens you up, man. Yeah, yeah. It, yeah. it Definitely, makes bro. you stronger. Yeah. I do. I do. Makes you stronger. For sure. I do not mind a little toughening up, especially when kids are together. I mean, it just make you a better person. Exactly. So bro. let's get into this uh, controversial let's get it. Uh, topic that uh, Dwayne Wade uh, recently uh, mentioned oh. on a <laughs> podcast, the Armchair Expert. Uh-uh. That's the podcast name. The Armchair what? Armchair expert. That's the podcast armchair, name. Armchair, yeah. D Wade was on. Y'all are stupid. Wade believes fans will eventually forget who Michael Jordan is because the oh. game continues to evolve. Y'all pray the, for Wade. Something's the game, obviously something's wrong with his brain. <laughs> the game continues oh, to keep moving forward. So we're gonna yeah. continue to see things we've never seen before. And the eyes are gonna get younger and younger. Yep. We're not gonna be the ones having the conversation about the goats. Now it's going to be the younger generation, and they're going to forget about the Jordans like we forgot about Kareem. So yep. people were responding on Twitter. You know, you know, Twitter is a such a great place. So oh peaceful yeah, super and, toxic. You know, <laughs> That's where but you go for all your toxic, <laughs> all news. your toxic needs. Someone, I stay on there with the Houston Rockets and the Houston Texans uh, Twitter. Yeah, it's so live. Nine, so it's uh, so live on there. It's wild. <laughs> One person said, I don't think so. The Jordan shoes will have his legacy living longer than any other professional basketball player. Six-year-old kids getting hyped for retros, which I'm like, shocks me sometimes. Someone said, love D-Wade, but brother, young fans are more likely to forget about you than MJ. I'm like, I mean, that's not even a question. (laughs) They went rogue. I mean, that's really not a question. Wait, but man, it it wasn't even about me. Do they got a picture of Jordan looking at him playing? (laughs) Boy, yeah. people are petty. And as he was a part of Jordan brand at one point. Yeah, he was. Yeah, my, them Jordan shoes wasn't really that, bro. Like Jordan, them shoes my, wasn't like, the best I, looking. But my still. only thing is this: because this is oh, and one more, one more. His logo is visible every time you leave your house. His logo is everywhere. Everywhere, it, it really is. And yep. I, I think this could uh, be a good conversation to have because yeah. there's he has some truth in what he's saying. But I'm not sure if I agree to with To an you. extent, yeah. All like, the way. See, that, that's how I feel. Yeah. Like, like I, I don't agree with the entire thing. And I don't that's his opinion. Think, I don't yeah, think Jordan will actually be forgotten. What I what I right. do agree with is the fact that the younger and younger crowd will start having different goals. Yeah, oh, definitely. Okay. Yeah, Similar like how we do. Like yeah. Steph in our Curry class, there's people that don't right even. Now. Like, there's mm-hmm. people that, exactly. That, there's yeah. people that have Steph Curry in their top. Steph Curry is not in my top, like, three. If I were to pick three right. of the no. best players, t- Steph Curry would not be him. No. Um, and uh, but Steph is amazing. Exactly. Yeah. Steph is a shooting. I think he's genius. the best shooter ever. Yeah. I yeah, think we're I definitely can, best we can shooter. all agree there. Yeah. I, I think, think he's yeah. the best shooter ever. But yeah. as far as an all around And he proved goal, it. Yeah, he did. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> My like like people now, like in our group, I, I hear a lot of LeBron, uh yeah, you know, Jordan. Mm-hmm. You're gonna have Jordan yeah. right now. Yeah. LeBron, Jordan, uh Kobe. You mm-hmm. know, those are like the three big ones for like our yeah. mm-hmm. little frame. Because we got to see them all. In the age group that we're talking about, yeah. we got to see them all. You know what I'm saying? Eighties, nineties. Like when I like when I was talking in the group, we, we talked about it previously before. Mm-hmm. But when I was talking in the group, one of the 
like the three that I was hearing a lot was like Curry, KD, and like LeBron. Or people were throwing Irvin in there, which was super fucking weird to me. Ooh, wow, Kyrie Irving. Oh, okay. it's just like what? Wow. And I, mean, I, never, heard, I never heard nobody. But really he's a I had either. Yeah, Irvin. Yeah, I, I heard never. that randomly. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> well, <laughs> that was my response. But whatever. <laughs> but um, I heard that uh, it was Curry, Flat Earth. KD, and LeBron. <laughs> oh lord. And yeah. um, they w- then they would mm-hmm. add like somebody random, but. Uh, Jordan, Jordan, of course, is going to pop in there, but it wasn't like as prominent as even ours. But I'm Jordan. sure before, during like the older people, Jordan's automatic. On there. Mm, yeah. Right. But it's some people right now in ours that's not even adding Jordan. But then like the younger guys I was listening to, I barely heard Jordan. Like it was like a his was, shoes dope. <laughs> makes sense. Yeah. Exactly <laughs> makes sense, you know. But so like I get that aspect of it, but I don't think he's going to ever be forgotten. Mm-hmm. Like, Even though won't be forgotten. Just bro, like, bro, like out of every generation of amazing basketball players, you can never be forgotten from. Will Chamberlain to Magic Johnson, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, like we still talking about him. Exactly. Yeah. But there's always going to be the That's certain true. ones we that are really going to forever stand out that, to where he changed the game. and He transcended. MJ was one. Kobe was another one, bro. Like, to we, where no matter years on down the road, certain basketball players will never be forgotten. And shit, MJ we were here one during, of them. We was here when Magic Johnson had theaters. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even so, know they went away. Like, which was hard. Went, Mm-hmm. Right? I used to be in the Magic Johnson theater Bro, all the time. You heard so. it on like pee. <laughs> <laughs> but they was cheap. Right. Mm-hmm. They were cheap, man. Affordable for a full family Facts. Yep, on a certain fixed income. Mm-hmm. But Facts. only only thing, man, I will say, um, I don't disagree with his opinion. I mean, I disagree with his opinion, but that's the thing, it's his opinion. Yeah. You know, I don't mm-hmm. I don't get too rattled about other people feeling I feel like Everybody gravitates towards certain players for a certain reason. Yeah. Yep. You know, everybody has a reason why somebody – I mean, we joke all day, me and the homies, about LeBron being trash and good. Yeah. But I already know LeBron <laughs> is going to be going down as one of the greatest play- players yeah. that ever Future played Hall the game. Right, yeah. no doubt. My only thing that I don't like is how I feel like every time we big up a player, we got to bring one down. Yep. Like, yes, when bro. I talk to my friends about it, well, Jordan never. It and it's bro, like, well, why that's... do we always got – and that's what yeah. – that's the literally the that only thing that irritates me with irritates. everything. Because it's just like, bro, why, all the players, bro. We, we can't just sit down and say LeBron's great and move on. It's that, always – That irritates Kobe me never – Everything, bro. Kobe didn't – and it's just like, come on, bro. I said one thing good. Let's say I say something good about Xbox. Oh, boy. You, you already know what's coming after that. Yeah. Well, well, PlayStation to blah, blah, blah. Yeah, like, yeah, what? Yeah. We have God I don't more. give a damn. I have both. <laughs> right. right. <laughs> I have both. That's I don't true. care. <laughs> I'm on a this PC, so it really like, doesn't matter. Rever- but people always feel like they yeah, have exactly. to throw their bullshit in there. Yeah. Like, you gotta, just be happy that he like his spe- Xbox and he like his PlayStation. But especially with sports, it's like they got to, in order to, come, like, they got to bring someone down in order to bring, big someone up. Yeah. yeah. And I don't like that in music. I don't like day, that in all sports. All of them are rich, and we're not. Especially, <laughs> so. Because my goats. My bro, goats, like. Facts. <laughs> Because my goats in uh, basketball aren't even the best players in the in the league. And they don't got to be. Like Vince like, Carter yeah. is one of my favorite players I, I ever. I agree. Vince Carter was a beast. Not, beast. Yeah. And he's not statistically the top three any, yep. any mm-hmm. of those. But you have your <laughs> personal reasons. And my thing has always been this. I may get clashed. But growing up, it was too hard for me to invest fully into shit that wasn't going to necessarily make me as successful as the person I was watching. Yeah. Understand. Mm-hmm. So... All these diehard fans of certain people, you can tell me when this nigga was born, at what time, what college, mm-hmm. what da, da, da. it's like you saying all this about yeah, this man life. What legacy are you leaving for your family? You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like I'm, I've always been on that. Like I'm big fans of a lot of things, but I'm a bigger fan of putting my name somewhere close to the person that I'm a fan of or yep. I watch. You know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. for real. listening to Drake, listening to Wayne. You know what I'm saying? Like I always had a cap. I ain't finna be out here. Arguing with niggas because oh no Wayne is the best, yeah. 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 bro. It ain't like, never that serious to me. I like him lyrically over Jay Z, like mm-hmm. not lyric, but just of, as an overall rapper, mm-hmm. I will listen to Wayne before Jay Z. That that's a, my oh, personal my that's preference. A whole other thing. They just count Wayne out of the verse, and I'm like, bro, no, nah, but I'm that's just, crazy because I hear the opposite. So, yeah. right, but just, I'm a Jay Z guy. But regardless, so. it's like <laughs> that's your preference because whatever you was probably going through something similar to what they were rapping about, or mm-hmm. you just gravitated towards mm-hmm. that. For a certain reason. It's music yeah, exactly. is yeah. broad. And one thing about music, it brings people of all different backgrounds together. Yep. So why are we arguing about, why we got to bring Wayne down to Big J up? Right. Well, we we can't say, hey, two, these two Wayne. black men Wayne. pioneered in mm-hmm. something. They came from a, Louisiana, <laughs> the streets of, you know, New York, where Jay-Z, Brooklyn, New York. New York. Just so New York, Brooklyn, come from yeah. the streets. New York. Yeah. yeah. Come from the streets. 
Look at what they made of themselves. <clears throat> Look at yep. the lives they living now. You know what I'm saying? Like we don't talk about that. We always argue about two rich people. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> with yeah, our, with with our like, broke asses. Exactly, bro. Like, <laughs> but, but my opinion matters because I'm broke. <laughs> reduce lunch still. Like the bro, LeBron, this LeBron, is, it and all LeBron, goes back to reduce LeBron lunch. LeBron yep. showed me who he was after they lost that game uh-huh. against the Mavs, and that boy had he was sitting there. He was, well, well, you know, we just gonna go back to doing this, and y'all still gotta go back to do what y'all do tomorrow. And he, like he was mad. I get it, bro. You big he mad. Was pissed. Niggas he was getting pissed. on your ass, but you came there. Oh, seven, eight. Nine, 19 rings, you know, but it's like because people was clowning in a sportful way. You know how niggas are with sports, and it's men. So dudes, testosterone, they <laughs> they saying what the hell ever. You lost, now you couldn't take it. Now you basically saying your bro guys got to get up to go to work in the morning. I'm gonna still be rich, <laughs> basically. Yeah, and I like that flex. <laughs> right? And I and as as long as, as much as it annoyed me, it grew on me, and I understood because I'm I like, love you know every what? bit of it. At the end of the day, <laughs> he we arguing facts. about this, this nigga. nigga. Yep. And he is rich as shit. You know how many mm-hmm. eyes on this man? How many people bitch about this man yep. every day? How many every times day. he has to see some hating ass comment? Every. You know how much that weighs you down. Yep. Yep. And sports people, I feel like the media. That's why I fuck with the LeBron. media. Do that too, like man. anybody that can stay as positive or like as up as he's standing he with all the, the shit he deal speed. with. He got the old. You got to in that lane, and shit. he's a and he's a very stand up guy. Like just yeah. outside of that's basketball, that's insane to me. Outside yeah. of basketball, the stuff he doing in his community, the school that he built for the kids and stuff like that to yeah. be able to come there and have an education for those that can't afford and stuff like that in certain neighborhoods. Mm-hmm. Like, see, that's why I understand Kanye more lately. Like, I've been like actually giving him more of a chance now because I'm like, I get it. You probably going the fuck crazy yeah. because yeah, he, all these eyes at this point. Like, yeah. it's just. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. I mean, he. I mean, honestly, he lost his mom, and oh yeah, from there you that just, don't help. You seen a shift, and now you yeah. don't have that one person who you usually would be able to call that on balance. to balance mm-hmm. you. You know, to kind of be, you know, to quiet all the noise around you. Just like, come here, give me a hug. Everybody know about you know just being able to get to someone that can, whether it's your wife, your dad. There's mm-hmm. a lot of dads like that. You know what I'm saying? But mm-hmm. people lose people that they used to be able to just go to and they yep. will feel like they will quiet the world down and you know stuff like that happen and you don't and somebody always snapping pictures trying to see what your reaction is going to yep. be eventually bro you'll go crazy and, and it comes full circle bro and they can't do that on accident it's it going to be full circle again, bro, be careful, what careful what you wish about, for man be careful what you wish for like, careful this, you got to have fame. tough skin you got to it is a cost because yeah. life gets spicy yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and and you know again with, with with D Wade, I hope this don't mess up your your relationship with Jordan because Jordan seems like he tallies. Jordan probably say. laughed at his ass. I'm sure he yeah. did <laughs> while he's smoking the cigar. Yep, with a cigar on the golf course. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. The biggest thing I, and the biggest thing I took away is they talk so much shit about Jordan to this day. Facts. That's how you Jordan know does he's not get a damn. Y'all not yep. letting his name down because exactly. you ain't comparing. You ain't say nobody else wasn't gonna be the goal no more. You didn't say Kareem. You said like Kareem, but people still acknowledge Kareem. Yep. You didn't talk about none of the other. You didn't say nobody and else that's where but Jordan. That's where that uh, his statement is incorrect. Yeah, because <laughs> yep. it's like, bro, I'm still relevant to the point to where we're still arguing this. Like, when I retire again? Oh, mm-hmm. yeah, that's right. Y'all still talking. Still talking. <laughs> still talking shit, let alone the shoes. Because for one thing, with the shoes being so iconic, mm-hmm. it, it makes people go back and research. Yep. Why? Yeah, though? bro. Yep. So that alone is forever. It, kids, I don't see the Jordan kids brand. Kids still actually like bringing up stuff about uh, like wanting to be like Jordan. Like, yeah. yeah. That's why, I mean, it goes like even off basketball. It's like, bro, <clears throat> want to be like Mike, be like Jordan, bro. It's like, shit, man, what's the word I'm trying to figure out? <laughs> I'm trying to come up with. It's like, it was like a lifestyle at one point. Even to this day, it's like, man, like, as in, I want to be the greatest. I want to be like MJ. As in whatever craft you're on and stuff, they use that term, and I want to be like Mike. Or even like how Kobe was like, he was so determined to win. Like nonstop, very competitive and killer instinct, you know, that drive, mm-hmm. you know? And like many other basketball players and just artists. Of course. And stuff, so. I, think, I think the thing also with both sports, basketball, football, or well, those two sports specifically, probably sports in general, but um, that I think they're going to start doing, like they've already started with football, is extending the seasons, extending certain things so records can be broken if they're sitting stagnant mm-hmm. because they want that so yeah, they can yeah. keep talking about that. Oh, definitely. Yep. Oh, I believe they're going to be looking like baseball. And to, uh, <laughs> to interject, since we were just talking about Kanye and Jordan, Kanye did uh, post a picture on Instagram today yeah. of the Jordan jump brand, uh, jump man symbol. That is another thing too. Yeah, and he, you know, they're trying yeah. to get something collab. in the work. Yeah, trying to get Yeezy's a billion dollar. You know, they said 
And I just recently found this out. Well, to no surprise, Kanye has made more money with Yeezy within the past, what, five, six years since it's been out, since he's ever did in the music industry. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can tell you that. Which is that, bro, that's just huge. And imagine the collab with Ye and Jumpman. Mm -hmm. Too much money. Oh, no. Yeah. You you thought the hype beast was... (laughs) No, it was, like, was in this infamous Super oh, Sane Thanos man, oh hype beast. God. Like, I wouldn't even, honestly meanwhile, I wouldn't even want it right now. No. I wouldn't. I meanwhile, wouldn't you got Elon Musk laughing at both of them. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. Oh, well, he's on Mars. <laughs> I wiped my ass with that money. Right? Right. <laughs> man. Jeff, right. Jeff, look at him, Jeff. Look at, look at him. Right. And then you got Bill Gates over there thinking I just bought Activision. <laughs> <laughs> $86 billion. I'll see y'all bitches on Saturn. Like, no. <laughs> what the I just bought yeah. Activision. Exactly. Just so, because I can. And Once we, again, we we talking about. And, and it's a whole other thing because, like, I would talk my shit about <laughs> Xbox players, but in a friendly way. Because at the end of the day, both the motherfuckers' company are rich as hell, and I'm not. So, <laughs> what 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 say do I have? Always, look? I've always had my cap, bro. If I argue with somebody about something that's not in my bank account, yeah, man, exactly. I have yeah. a you got to let it go. Why are me and you arguing about that, none of it? It is. You got to have one of you start arguing. You be like, wait a second, right? Why? I'm, I'm a guy. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. What well, Ross just said about Activision. So yeah, man, uh, Microsoft. They said, "Hey, man, bossed up." They pulled a Disney. They pulled. They a did. Disney. They 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 have been buying studios and stuff. But the fact that they bought Activision Blizzard, they for that much. I want let me get the exact number. Do you know they the exact number offhand? Seventy six point uh, something billion. It's more than what like, I got in my account right exactly. now. Exactly. <laughs> so Wait, all boy. y'all fanboys out there from either PlayStation and Xbox, still just. Shut up. I'm always gonna have friendly competition. I, I like I'm a Halo fan, so I would definitely get an Xbox manager just for Halo, the Halo franchise. Mm-hmm. But other than that, I've always been I'm like PlayStation. I'm, you know, PlayStation always been my I started with game. PlayStation. That's why I never hate on PlayStation. Sixty eight yeah. point seven billion dollars. Billion. Not millions, billions. Billion with A B. Exactly, man. Just like it's not like it's a regular Wednesday. <laughs> now I've heard recently and I I didn't know nothing Damn. about this. There's a possibility that it could not happen. Because mm-hmm. there's something called a monopoly or some shit where oh, companies yeah. can't yep. have certain... Yeah, I didn't know that. Because yeah. I just said Disney got everything. But damn, technically, so. Disney's doing the same thing. Exactly. So I'm like, how does that... Everything. They so businesses like that they find not loop arounds, Yeah, they find workarounds. They're they going to find a loop around. Disney okay, is well. pretty... You In media, they're kind of a, uh, a monopoly, bro. Because... Yeah. Everything either they don't it's own all fair. of it, they get a percentage of it. Best you believe, coming through us, boy. Mickey Mouse is getting that cheese, <laughs> oh, that cheddar. Yep. So it, it's one of those type of things where it's like, yeah, you know, the I think this is the FCC, I believe, that try to go against you know companies having a monopoly on certain the things. FCC won't let me be. I was well, about I don't think it's yeah. like, oh, no, it may not be FCC. <laughs> oh. It may be uh, nah, 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 nah. it may be something else. Nah, but correct nah, me nah, if I'm wrong. Nah, nah, nah. But basically. Disney's been doing it, and you know when you got enough money, bro, who gonna tell you no? Exactly. That's literally what it well, comes down well, to. Well, you're a mono- okay. I'm sorry. People, I watch, <laughs> I watch a, a lot way, of videos man. about this, and people kept bringing it up with a monopoly. So I'm like, how? Like, cause it seemed like it ain't stopping Disney. No, Disney. I'm surprised no Disney. Ain't, t- I'm surprised Disney ain't bought damn Microsoft or it Sony be, or some it shit. It could be one of those like, situations. I'm not selling this product. Disney come yeah. to you. We'll give you one billion. Wouldn't that be crazy? No, yeah. two billion. They Disney buys no. Nintendo. That would ten billion. Boy, and then it'll just become we're just gonna buy it because we can. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, but I said no, it doesn't matter. We yeah. we gonna take it, but I said no. I bought it's your job. Ours. I bought it. I we bought it already. We wait, also wait. bought the building next door. We wait, wait, bought the. Yeah. We own the government. You see niggas moving boxes. Yeah. Wait, where these niggas come? We, we own the government. Yeah, that desk you're at, that's mine. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> Oh, I didn't agree to it. Take them new. Your uh, wife signed off on it. Yeah. Wait, what did bro, she? you just see the, the Mickey Mouse Club, bro, just posted everywhere. So <laughs> look, look, take them new Jordan Get Yeezys the fuck off. Out. <laughs> take them, take them new exclusive Jordan Yeezys off and give them over. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, on yes. their property of Disney now, you can cop them at the Disney World. Yeah. Jeez, yeah. Jeezys. Yeah. Hold on. Oh yeah, Jeezys? we got them. Yeah, Jordans. Mm-hmm. Jordans or Jeezys. Let me have that hat too. Yeah, yeah. yeah let me have that. <laughs> which <laughs> which, <laughs> which name? Jordans. Jordans or Jordans or Jeezys. Which one are we going Damn. with? It got to be the Jeezys, man. The Jeezys. That young G. Hey, cut the check. Yes. Jeezy, young Jeezy. Jeezy, man. his, his 10%. Jeezy, right? There yeah. you go. 2%. 10. <laughs> hell no. No telling what he Kanye, be a billionaire. Man. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, bro. They have a lot of nigga billionaires. Right. What's he doing here? Fuck wrong so, with you. So, yeah, man. Uh, and there's a lot of people with that old money, bro. 
Now, Definitely this, old money. This money, is old bro. money right here. Oh, we talking about old money. Mm-hmm. Talking about man, nineteen seventy the being in bills. Shit. shit before that. For exactly. All you gotta do is drive in Houston, man. Sometimes you go to River Oaks. Oh yeah, a lot mm-hmm. of old money there. Yep. Talking about old money. Mm-hmm. So uh-huh. at the end of the day, there's no point of arguing over these yeah. things that we have no stock in. <laughs> None. None. You can have a debate and leave it at that, but you know everyone is entitled to their own opinion, and no opinion is wrong. You can choose to like whatever you like. You can choose to call whoever you want to call the goat. It's your but opinion, at the bro. end of the day, man, we nope. don't own none of that shit. As long as my, <laughs> as long as my, as long as my bank account the goat, I don't give a damn. Yeah, man. Exactly. That's what I'm who trying to find out who the goat is. Damn it. bank account. You got it. I ain't arguing with nobody yep. no more. 2022 beyond. If you Bro, said LeBron is the greatest this specimen nigga tweeted, ever man. Phil, Pistolman? Phil Spencer, I think he's one you of the... You said uh, oh. I don't know what I said, actually. <laughs> We're going to find out. Yeah. <laughs> he tweeted, yes, oh, Phil Spencer. Had a good call this week with the leaders of Sony. Like, they just talking a foreign language to us. Right. I had a good call this week with the leaders of good Sony. Call. I confirmed our intent to honor the existing agreements upon the acquisition of Activision Blizzard to our desire to keep the Call of Duty on the PlayStation Sony. You, you have is an to important still, part like, of our industry, and we value our relationship. All I heard was money. Exactly. <laughs> Sony's like, hey, Mo, all right, you do, all right, well what played. I, what I heard so, is right. we're going to slowly finesse them into making everything cross-platform. Right. <laughs> yes. Basically, yeah. I can't yes. wait. Can't wait. Sony's Bro. like, please stop buying things. Right. Yes, Please. I love it, bro. It's, it's time. Yes, finally, it's man. time across these be platforms. Able to game together on everything, and there's still including be 2K. Some... I had a dream, including yes. 2K, <laughs> that I, one I, day it ain't happened yet. To be honest, PlayStation like... and Xbox <laughs> and PC <laughs> will <laughs> all come together. <laughs> and and then, nah, y'all can keep PC over there. Oh, with PC. Oh, well, yeah, PC. We don't want them. They can stay over there. Yeah, because PC do have a higher. They, yeah, they, they have yeah, a better. They got way too much going on. Yeah. <laughs> they can, people, we don't want nothing to do with y'all anyway. Maybe the bitches. slower PCs. <laughs> 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 and Nintendo, if you would, you know, want to be Nintendo is be so cool. damn stingy, bro. They, 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 oh, they, they making their money in their corner. Jordan, yeah. Let's, let's yo, get the fuck away from us, okay? Old money. Old money for sure. Oh my nigga is right. They said we've been here. It's the Mickey Mouse doing this Mario. Shit. Like, Mario is gonna live forever. We started okay. this shit. Exactly. You wanna know who started this? That's the one person that ain't gonna ever go away. Yeah. 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 We ain't agreeing to none yep. of your bullshit, okay? <laughs> Let's go. go. Like, we're playing and, together and only with us. Yep. Fuck and all when y'all. I tell you the kids are hooked, like my kids, every time they want a Mario game, I ask them why. Because it's, it's, it Mario. Not, it's Mario Kart. It's Mario Party. 3D World. Mario it's Party. Mario. Paper Mario. And I'm watching this and I'm like, bro, it's nothing Because changing. whoever made Mario was a genius and knew it would always work for every generation. Yep. yep. An Italian <laughs> and plumber. They, he made it for the future. Yeah, yep. man. And Nintendo <laughs> said, Japan. All they got to do is change the graphics and make it better with that's, the generation. I think that's the one company that Disney won't be able to get. <laughs> No, no, no. I'll get you one day. Nintendo Bro, literally can make the same say, Mario from ninety and whatever, yep. and then just change the graphics and have the exact same levels and be yep. somebody my age gonna buy it. Yep. <laughs> Bro, when the Wii came out, like yep. mm-hmm. that just that idea over. alone was just it skyrocketed, do, 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 and that was exercise. People yep. was like, I ain't exercise a yeah. no game. Do, 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 Look at. You had the old folks wanting that just shit hard. Yeah. Uh-huh. Like, that shit was yeah. hard. I had it. Why was it not my nah, going hand? Dope. You yep. was? I hit yep. my hand on didn't some shit. No I'm not going to lie. But still, I had fun. I wanted so. a weed, but I didn't want to feel like y'all just. I didn't have weed. a weed. It was my oh, weed. I think I was in like. <laughs> it was. That came out in 06, I think. Because yeah, like, right. originally it was supposed to be the Nintendo school. Revolution. But yeah, my dad. My dad and them bought it for working out and shit. See, yeah, a lot and of a lot of the old school. Yeah. But boo, this ain't for you, buddy. Trying to get my steps up. It was it was fun. That's crazy. So <sighs> you still haven't seen Spider Man yet? Jesus, Damn man, I, go Bro, I have been dealing with house shit. Yeah. I have not even oh, sat down. We get it. Oh, yeah, we, we got you. I forgot what sitting down means. I had a, I had a, I had a couple questions. Yeah, like I'll have my Xbox on and not even be playing that. Bitch. You know what? You on. know what movies are coming out next this year, right? Yeah, like Doctor Strange mm-hmm. and stuff. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think we had that conversation. I told you, I'm you just had right, right. low key this weekend might be the weekend. I'm not gonna lie because I've got a lot of. Free time for once. Well, let us know. I got know, the wash man. and dryer. Let, yeah. let us know, man. Got a lot of shit. And they're they're still promoting sake. it like as if it just dropped. <laughs> it just came which is, up. Which is good, man. I mean, it's yeah. that good. They no. getting that much money. Now I'm way out. So, so wait, uh, Avatar is supposed to be coming out with a game. A game? Because I looked at all the games that's I guess supposed to be coming out this year, oh, um, 2022. So Avatar is supposed to be coming out with a game. Um, They've been talking that? about that for a while. Well, they said it was coming out this year. I look, they show like graphics and like you know, of course, gameplay. Yeah. 
Um, I was like, "Wait, well, you look just like the damn movie." Um, that's good. It yeah. better. It better. God damn it! I'm looking it up right, right now. The games is coming out. Avatar, Avatar: Frontiers of Pandora is set to be released 2022. Yeah. Wow. Smooth, that's that's smooth. Yeah, you gotta say it like that. <laughs> you can't be like Avatar Adventures of Pandora. No, you gotta ready to for team. <laughs> ready like, to. I want, I want like a dope Deadpool game. I'm trying to has not came out I think out that'll yet. be a dope ass game. Dope ass single player. And I feel like talk to you every now yeah. and then. Yeah, I feel like Spider Man yeah, definitely be breaking cool. that barrier of like having its own like. Yo, little. that goddamn Miles Morales uh, game. I, yeah. So you said you just swung, bro. I you got can on, just swing. I got on Spider Man and I was just swinging, just feeling the, you know, the. Just, <laughs> bro, he yeah, I didn't play it really, it really bro. Me. And I was intrigued just by seeing the graphics. I'm like, damn, damn it's just how really right. it feels. So you get you'll get caught up just sitting there talking to somebody and be like, I was in a party bro, and like, I was just swinging and fighting little crimes that kept popping up. Oh, let me <laughs> let me go beat this dude up. <laughs> and then you can replay the mission and get new to unlock new like skills and stuff like That's that. What's up. Uh, replayed the whole game, repeated. <laughs> I'm ready for a Miles Morales movie. Man, bro, there's Bruh. so much talk. Not like, not Spider Verse, not, not that. Not yeah. the actual, yeah. actual Miles. Morales. We're talking about live action. Yeah, live action. Yeah. So, so I'm with that. Yeah. Eventually incorporate him in. You know, they've been teasing it. They have. Mm-hmm. And uh, once again, you know, Sony. Who could yeah. play it though? It got to be like a, a new name, new face. Hmm. Y'all see a, or an existing actor playing yeah, it? Or? No, they had yeah. um. What's that boy's name? Um, he, what is he? He plays in a few shows. Because it was it was side by side of who they want. Like, yeah, I, I'm they pretty wanted sure a, you know the, the, the black about. kid from Stranger Things to play Static Shock. Yeah, oh, I remember him. And it was another one. It was Wait. like the other black kid. The one the little fro? Yeah. yeah. They say mm-hmm. he could play a good Static Shock. They said him for Static Shock and then the black he kid. He's kind of small to me, though. Yeah, he is. Well, like, I you know, know it's been years. Grown up now. Yeah, well, years. I'm talking about like I don't know skinny. if y'all, I can't remember the name of the show. It was like an old school, like 80s, Disney will get like 70s. <laughs> yeah. It was like a little, uh, yeah, yeah. four. Uh, it was like four kids. They were like, I guess starting hip hop or something like that. It was like a, what the oh, hell? the one on Netflix. Yeah. The, the, the one with the dude with the fro and he's, he tried to get to the Mexican girl. Chick oh, uh, dope. You, no. Are you talking about the dude from Dope? The dude, yeah, from, dude dope. from Dope. Okay, yeah, okay, dope. Him, yeah. Dude from Dope. Yeah, yeah the black, uh, the that black guy. Hair. I can't remember yeah, his name. I, him, I mean, he could little short dude. He played the voice yeah, of. Black, 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 black. He played the voice. He of played the voice. Yeah, he but, could be him. But I liked him, like in comparison he to actually be. be him. Well, would be dope. it's funny because in that show, I don't think it's called Dope. The one I'm talking about with you, but. Mm-hmm. Cause it was like a '70s type mm-hmm. vibe, but but they canceled he was it jumping after like season. Two yeah, he was something. DJing the, or something. Get down yes, or something like the that. get down. Get yeah. down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. He was jumping around and shit with the DJ equipment. I think, uh-huh. or and I was like, oh. Shamik, Shamik Moore, Shamik Moore. Yeah, yeah Shamik yeah. Moore. There yep. we go. He could be a dope Miles Morales, but mm-hmm. like yep. somebody brought it up to me, they was like, he should be, he should be mixed, and I was like, well, that would be more accurate, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> so like, I, I mean, you can I, get. I mean. You can get away with some type of It was just away, like, I like of, him. I like him a lot for it. That's yeah. the reason why I was like, eh, I don't yeah. know. Who's right. to say Mickey Mouse ain't already pulling the strings I as we speak? I would be surprised Mickey Mouse already has somebody. Yo. Oh, Cause Cause he's in a hyperbolic time chamber as we <laughs> speak. Chill, bro. Yeah. Those niggas don't play, shape, bro. Yeah, all right. Hey, we need to stop talking about that. Those niggas don't play, bro. Exactly. Uh, in the class, we, get a in the class, we get a copyright now. What the hell, man? My goddamn computer. I'm sorry. Like, We're listening. Mm-hmm. We sorry, yeah. you know. Just chill, Disney, bro. It's all love. We Side, it's like we good. Shit. I've chill. been there. Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. <laughs> <laughs> My chill, kids bro. love you, man. I take them to everything. Right. <laughs> Plan on doing the Disney cruise. <laughs> oh, chill, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we Sorry. love you, Disney. I love you. I get some tickets. We love Disney. you, Disney. I love you. <laughs> yep, that's exactly love you, what it, it's yeah, crazy, that. man. How Disney just. They've been uh, thinking you know, of a master plan. Yep. <laughs> the boss hogs. Yep. No, facts. Man. Well, that's the kind of stuff that we're trying to build. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you should always uh have some type of goal to take, you know, create new ideas. Hell, I don't think they expected Facebook to become what it has. Oh no, yep. I sure as hell didn't. Um <laughs> like I mean, crazy. Mm-hmm. Like I metaverse now, yeah. now everything's supposed to be like virtual. Yeah, you in the virtual that world. Point, man. I that. thought not going outside no more to actually meet people was crazy, but now you actually don't have to go outside, but you will be outside in mm-hmm. some universe. Yep. It just won't be the real reality world. Yep. The universe. More, more of the story. I feel is, like that's just going to get more dangerous. It's the matrix is happening. It's, 
It's coming Think, full things circle. Things is going to get a little bit weirder out there. I feel like it's going to mess with a lot of people. Mentals. Like, the the you know? one time it's going to get weird is when they start putting uh, the, the where you can feel things. Ooh, and you can put it, put it in your areas and stuff like that. And you can be on porn or you oh, can boy. you can be <laughs> got the one guy doing this you know what's great <laughs> boy, you gonna be, this world over at that moment yep. that's it oh, sorry well, you can feel what you yeah. watching on there porn there will be no more uh, communication right. between humans <laughs> yeah, i don't even need you <laughs> you skip to tab are 23 you right. are you something tripping? new today oh big you bet. plug into it oh so oh i'm sorry honey you got a headache <laughs> right, i'm going to my <laughs> other world my, yep going to the verse right yep going the to the verse i got no headaches over there like, I don't get to hear nobody talk shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> nah, the world's yeah. over at that moment. I just will see, say that now. Me think that. <laughs> see? Ain't that bad. See that? See? That's Tell me, bro. <laughs> but, but you know what's crazy? Like, I remember as like a Go kid, home. like, you know, they're like little parodies, like virtual reality. And so now in present day, it's becoming more norm. I know Sony has their the VRs yeah, or whatever. Sony I'm has like, their VR. Which I said, who's, you said you're going to get one. I'm waiting for somebody to buy yeah. one. I'm, I'm about to get an Oculus soon. Okay, Ooh, yeah, yeah, I want to see how, yeah. Boy. It's fun. It is, okay. Oh, yeah, I my, want my one. My uncle has one. So, like, I tried it. That's the only reason I'm really, like, at first I brought it up. And he was like, you know I got one, right? So he That's got crazy. the really? That's a flex. And I went and played it. <laughs> and I was like, playing this boxing game, I ended up punching a fence. That shit hurt, but See, could, yeah. <laughs> but the game was fun as fuck. And then like the lobby that you stand in, you kind of like you're picking what you want to do and it's stuff. Crazy, That's so lit. it's it's really dumb. I want to get that. So like I'm I'm really thinking about grabbing. But it. But I'm also getting. I think I'm planning on getting the um, like the racing games, but the like the setup with the steering oh, wheel. Oh yeah, be oh, yeah. I'll be too. I don't know. You end up crashing. Oh shit! Like well, no, it's not gonna be virtual. It's gonna actually be. I'm just gonna be like in front of the monitor, mm-hmm. and I'm just gonna have like the wheel and stuff. Oh, I'm thinking so, like virtual racing. No, you, like, can, you can do it. Like, you can do it. Yes, you can. Yeah, yeah. but it's I want to. I want to get the like just the wheel and the gear shift and all that. That's okay. That was yeah. fun. It, yeah, I'm not very good on it, but it's fun. Oh, that shit. Like that, on the actual steering wheel. Yeah. Like, right. The first time I did it, I was not because it like. I, the last time I did it was years ago though, so it wasn't as it probably doesn't read as good Bro, as like you know, the, ones the technology now. Now, now they yes. probably they yeah. probably don't now. The graphics is literally. Yeah, I've hell. seen someone use it where he had like the uh the Oculus set up, mm-hmm. but it's then he crazy. has the the actual rig, but he also has a motor on it. So when he it, accelerates, it, the, he, he, he feels feel it. it. Bro, now you just rip love. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty Ooh, dope. Like a lot. Yeah, I was like, yo, that's tough. So when he you couldn't get me out the house, he just. Seat just going crazy, bro. That's and dope. I'm like, yo, that's so you can feel the acceleration. It gives you that sensation mm-hmm. of. Well, you you be ready to get back home after getting off work. You like shit. Yeah, yeah. Get, back <laughs> home. Like, get back get to back the crib. Right. Hey man, you man. Some dinner? All right, I'll hey, be on it. Hey off, man, let me get on the off road. Yeah man, I'm about to, <laughs> hey you, you ready to oh, race? Oh, yeah. I got my Lambo shit. Let's do this, bro. <laughs> look, we're gonna look at each other. Hell yeah. <laughs> To that train track, like faster, <laughs> not, not the faster than me. Boy, get hit by the train. Oh my! <laughs> do you want to do that, Ross? <laughs> uh, and then somebody hit the nose too soon. Rookie, Rookie move. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Rookie mistake. Yeah. Rookie mistake. Oh, hit him with the shake and bake. Come on, <laughs> I'm right behind me. That actually would be kind of loud. That shit would be fun, bro. That I seen somebody well. on Instagram. He was having the time of his life. I'm, I'm doing it. I'm Even doing when it. he crashed, years. it was just going crazy. He was like, oh, you shit. You know me, bro. I started looking up everything on Amazon mm-hmm. and on YouTube of how to do the it's setup. It's an expensive rig, rig, but it's, that's something that you, you definitely. Well, it's, it's more affordable ones. You know, for the yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, <laughs> nah, because if you're not like used to doing it, mm-hmm. some of the, like, they, I'll be even talk, listening to some people talk about the certain wheels you get. Like, mm-hmm. there's some that you probably can't control if you yep. haven't been used to already yeah. doing yep. it. So, I'm, I'm a, I'm a like baby step my way into this. Yeah. Thing. The different types for sure. Yeah, that, that shit was definitely cool. So, hey, man, the future, you know what I'm saying? If you can really feel like you in a race car, I'm pretty sure they can build something where you feel like you really having sex with this point star. Bro, man. GTA going to be crazy. Woo. <laughs> man, that's man. probably, I'm that's that's why they take them forever game. to make the, the GTA next one. on an Oculus? Yeah, they plotting. Ooh. That's what they doing. See, in GTA <laughs> made me, in the I used to go <laughs> get a hook and go to the back of a building. So what's wrong with me, man? <laughs> you have to do it. You Yo, just want to see the car shake. Go around to the window just to see what's going on in there. And then you kill him and get your money back. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Savage. We were a little savage. Ross through the codes. That's how you yeah. have to do it. Right? Yeah, 
your money back. Girl, you think you feel like <laughs> well, what are all my Give me money? That grip. Then, the, then the old GJ they used to walk up to you like yeah. this. Yeah. yeah. And it hands. Start shooting at you like what the hell? <laughs> For no damn reason. <laughs> Bro, Bro, you bump what? into somebody and they ready to steal off on you. What's that you flung, fool? Boys <laughs> <laughs> grows, man. And they're, they're still <laughs> Hey CJ. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> <laughs> CJ. <laughs> So much racism in that game. Oh, so much man, facts. man. I wonder what they were doing at the computer at the table coming up with this shit. I mean, they you don't have to look a lot too of the, hard. It's based say, off our, off the real world. Bro. I was about to say, a lot of it was like Boys in the Hood and mm-hmm. a bunch Definitely of other. Every hood movie from the 90s. Yeah, I was about to say, Senate uh, Dress. Minister Society. Senate Dress was so many hood movies yep. mixed yeah, in one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> For real, man, which is crazy. Well, yeah, man. Ooh, hey, this was a good one, man. This is yep. a dope podcast, man. If y'all enjoyed this, man, episode 65. Yes, sir. Another one sir. for the books, man. Y'all keep running this up and listen to wherever yes, you can sir. listen to podcasts, man. Yep. Yep. Keep on supporting us. Hey, put some topics down below. Join yep. in on the conversation, the discussions. Let us know what y'all thinking. Um, yeah, we're trying to run it up in the podcast game. Facts. Yes, so. And don't forget yep. to listen wherever you can find your podcast on all platforms. <laughs> this, is your, <laughs> this is ITC Podcast. Nice. <laughs> We're at you again. We're Sponsor Bob coach. Tabasco. <laughs> no, Sponsor Bob. Tabasco nah, Poppy. Nigga, you better chill out. Yeah, man, I was playing. He's joking. He's joking. Bro. Yeah, we just, <laughs> just joking, huh? Like, get an email. Uh, we did not sponsor this podcast. Yeah. We're going to have to get, take that video, take down. This video down. Oh, my God. Just playing. Bro. Just playing. We got four niggas talking about our sauce. <laughs> get them out of here. Abort. Damn. We got four niggas talking about our sauce. <laughs> Facts, bro. I know money I put in on y'all shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. ain't gonna do me. <laughs> we know y'all put it on brand. Goddamn chicken I bought. Y'all motherfuckers. Hell, <laughs> you niggas in Pelican oh. Bank, right? There, you? Before we go, vegan chicken at KFC now. Disrespectful, yeah, bro. Um, chicken, chicken wings at Taco Bell. What the yeah. hell is going on? Disrespectful. They, they out. Someone we said the vegan, some. the vegan chicken nuggets look like deep fried erasers. That's exactly what that whole <laughs> deep fried <laughs> erasers. Deep fried. That's exactly <laughs> both. <laughs> Yo, somebody, they do. They somebody like was like, like the so, nuggets or something. Somebody was like, "Yeah, I went to get some vegan chicken, but they dipped the vegan chicken uh, wings in uh, actual chicken grease." So I don't understand the purpose of these. <laughs> vegan- <laughs> what the hell, y'all do? Like, <laughs> wait a minute. I don't get it. <laughs> oh bro, what my did you, god! What did you bro. do to me? Because Look, now I'm, I'm no longer change, vegan, bro. Just, just stick with y'all greasy. Horrible goodness shit. Bro. We don't want you no. Know, if we want some healthy shit, we are gonna cook it at home. We're gonna yeah. like, like, or so just build it. build new vegan like. You know what's crazy? Exactly. You know, yeah. know what's crazy though? In, in in Cali, when I went to Cali in San Diego, it's funny because my girlfriend. I mean, not my girlfriend. My brother's girlfriend. Mm-hmm. She's like she has like certain foods she can eat. She can only eat certain foods, mm-hmm. and they have to be like non gluten and random yeah. shit like that. That's in Cali, they cater to you. Right. right there. She came out here. She was like. Can I get the uh, a burger with none uh, gluten? Girl, if you don't get the- none. <laughs> and they were they were confused. It was like I don't I don't know what you're asking for. Right. Uh, well, ba- ba- this burger part. Basically, you, I don't want like, the bun. Right. I don't want the such and such. But I just need the lettuce, tomatoes, and uh in the in the patty. And he was like, uh, Okay, you want a number three? <laughs> <laughs> I know exactly. How about how about I, how about I get you a number three? So like and you take, take the bread off. Yeah. You take the bread. Hell yeah. <laughs> You remove the gluten. Yep. So Cali already has it to where they, they're yeah. health conscious like that. Mm-hmm. So it's now like it's so many people starting to become that way that it's coming down here. That's what mm-hmm. I'm noticing. Because mm-hmm. like we went over there and I was like, damn, they actually have places. They were like, so would you like it the gluten free or blah, blah, blah. I see, was like, look, I, they never asked me this before. I don't right. even know what that means, man. And see, I don't knock it, but I just feel like just build a vegan restaurant. There, there like you go. shouldn't yeah. have to I change agree. the recipe at a OG spot. Yeah. That it's unhealthy it, for a reason, my right. boy. Right. Yeah. It tastes good that That's way. Why it's cheat like, day, bro. I'm supposed to be yeah, it's right. cheat day, man. Like, no, I'm trying to cheat. You got exactly. me to help. Right. I don't want no deep fried erasers, my nigga. Give me that. <laughs> That's exactly what <laughs> it looked like, chicken bro. Chicken out here, bro. Deep like, fried erasers. Give me that chicken. Yeah. All right. Bullshit. Yeah. Out. This green box. Get yeah, get, yeah, get that green box out of here. got a green box. On a cool. Can we just be honest? That The colonel on that, oh, they mascot. I always got racist vibes from it. Always. 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 always been. Yo, Yo, that shit who don't? <laughs> nigga, I mean, <laughs> you're equal now, so get your ass back in Then get... I always think about Django every time I see him yeah, now bro. after seeing that, so it made that it even worse. That white ass suit with yeah, that bro. Boy, racist tie and bro. glasses. I just, I always got racist vibes from it, but they potato wedges was good. <laughs> the most hit. The most yeah, hit. bro. Why? Well, I still eat that chicken. They used to call them potato whips. The potato whips. <laughs> <laughs> Be like that, bro. You see the box current? Oh, you know, motherfucker hit. You got a racist ass Tater motherfucker whips. on there. Oh, yeah, good old day. That's that yeah, good old yeah, racist deep fried shit. Racist deep fried <laughs> colonel. Mm-hmm. Now he all vegan. <laughs> he, so changed. he changed. He changed. 
Right. Next you're gonna have a rainbow box one. We are inclusive. Of, yeah, yeah. He had we a got, change of heart. We like all different nuggets. We like all nuggets. All kind. Yep. All nuggets matter. Fuck all nuggets, you, right? matter. All nuggets matter. <laughs> no, nah, on a colorful box, you know, a chicken with two bones in it. <laughs> <laughs> We're all inclusive over here. Uh, <laughs> we thinking about everybody. <laughs> Thinking here's about your, all the money. I mean, everybody. Uh, <laughs> here's your oh. bucket of chicken, sir. Right. <laughs> Enjoy. Your money matters. <laughs> it's, it's the two bones, right? With the, one on both ends. We got non-binary chicken over here, y'all. <laughs> oh my we god. We get the extra crispy. <laughs> no, we got, was, we got uh, sapio chicken. <laughs> oh Our chicken my, was yep. bread. <laughs> you decide the chicken. Right. Yeah, you decide <laughs> you the chicken. Just, Actually, just, come in and cook it. You, <laughs> yeah. you come and do it. You can raise the chicken and you can see if it's going to be a male or female or non-binary. Hold, hold, hold on, hold on. No, I'm a rooster, I'm not just, a chicken, okay? <laughs> I identify myself as a rooster only. And you're going to call me a rooster on the menu. Exactly, on the menu, yes. <laughs> undecided. Kentucky undecided. Fried Rooster. Yeah, undecided like, like chicken Undecided strips. fried chicken? Undecided. <laughs> just call I'm me. like an undecided ass woman, man. Okay. You know, like, did you want, like... Dude, Don't bring me enough for this. Like, oh my god, we oh, done. Oh, bro, nah, we out of here, sorry, man. Sorry, bro, we had we couldn't resist. Like, Before we yeah, get we canceled, love everybody, man. damn it, we love y'all. Peace out. Man. Exactly. <laughs> I decided chicken. Where the fuck did this come from? <laughs> <laughs>